Gain of six on the play, second down and four. Alexander looks to his left, steps up, and he wants to run again. And he does so and steps out at the 17-yard line. And that's another gain of six, and that'll move the chains. Not only will it move them three on the season, two and one in big sky play. That's good for a tie for fourth place. Alexander fakes the handoff and runs again and dives forward, rolls across the five-yard line, but that's where they're going to spot him down at the ground. But with Hoffman and Alexander, it's going to be really challenging to stop that backfield. And there's a handoff, and the touchdown is scored by Portland State, scoring that number 22, Malik Walker, 7 of 11 on the season. And that kick is on its way. It's long enough, and it is good. A 56-yard kick, longest of the season, a career long for Cody Williams, and Portland State leads it 10 to nothing. Bruce Bo And the handoff is to Degbu, the wide receiver, who takes it off to the right side, and he wrestles his way across the 45 to the football come loose. It may have, but Portland State's got it. Alan Chapman, number 17 in there, a backup quarterback who took the snap on first down. Alexander's back in there. He turns, hands it off. Good balance shown by Sergio Hoffman. He takes it to the 39-yard line, and that'll move the chains again. Second down and five. And Alexander. Well, he has happy feet. Look at him dance around. Finally finds a man open, and that's Degby. And he's hit at the 19-yard line. That's another Portland State first down. So back up of five yards to the 14-yard line. Still first down and goal. And the draw is to Hoffman, and he weaves his way through the Bear defense into the end zone for the touchdown. Sixth rushing touchdown of the season for Sergio Hoffman, the senior from Gresham, Oregon. Northern Colorado, by the way, three timeouts remaining in the half. That pass is lofted and caught, intercepted by Portland State. Greg Oliver was the only player in the area, measured the sideline, hauled it in, kept his toes in bounds, and Portland State takes the football away and all of the momentum in the stadium. Oh, man, you talk about a crushy play right here. Could have had a touchdown on the run. Could have had a touchdown on the pass. The play before it gets called back, and then a miscommunication and an interception by Portland State. Pick up a first down on the previous play. And now Alexander wants to throw it out there. He's got a man, and that pass is caught by Degbu. He wrestled it away, takes it to the end zone. Touchdown, Vikings! How quickly things can change in the game of football. Northern Colorado could have been down only by three points. They give up a turnover deep in their own territory, and then Degbu able to go and take this ball on a fly route, catch the rock and take it all the way into the end zone. That's a 14-point swing right before halftime. And oh, by the way, there's that. Hoffman right up the middle and sprinting toward the end zone, and he's got a Portland State touchdown. That's a dangerous play diving in there when you're palming the football and yeah. that slips out and goes through the end zone. That's a touchback the other way, but. It's 161 yards, two touchdowns. The Bears got to stop that guy. First and 10 from the 25, Alexander to throw, and that pass is caught by Cutter. That's his first grab of the day. Do you blitz as well, here it comes. And Alexander rolls out. He was going to run, and he's got the first down and more, and he slides down safely at the 20-yard line. Heads-up play by Davis Alexander. First four games of the season, splitting time at quarterback. Jelani Eason, touted player out of Los Angeles. He's been hurt. This is Hoffman again, shaking his shoulders and taking the ball inside the 10 to the 8-yard line. Davis. Alexander keeps it and he gets into the end zone right side touchdown well this isn't a typo but this could have been a touchdown in two different ways if you would have had the give 
the running back Sergio Hoffman would have walked in the end zone, but Alexander holds on to the rock, goes to the right side, and is untouched into the end zone. Uh, Just a gain of one, second down at nine. Nip lost that pass out, and it is intercepted. Picked off by Anthony Adams, his fourth pick of the season. He had two last week in the shutout.